Finally got them, but in this video we are not going to be messing with them. That'll be saved for next video. So I'm getting into a lot of different metals here and there's just no reason for that. It just happens to be coming my way. This copper 101 machines a lot like brass, obviously. I mean, there's copper within brass, the alloy of brass. Looking at Brunel hardness, it is very similar to that of aluminum. It's actually softer than aluminum. The Brunel hardness for aluminum is right around 100 and for this copper here, it's right around 85-ish. So it's kind of weird, I mean this is a much heavier, much more dense material than aluminum. Where aluminum is like 2.7 grams per centimeter cubed, and this is like 9 grams per centimeter cubed. Which is weird because it seems to machine like it is harder than aluminum. Just because of the weight of it might cause it to machine like it's a little bit harder than aluminum, but in fact it's really not harder than aluminum. And I also ended up bumping up the, the coolant on the fog buster here. And that's just because I know that this stuff gets hotter quicker and when it gets hotter the tool gets a little bit hot and the part actually got hot. After the first big pass of the adaptive clearing that I did uh, when I clear everything out on the first operation I noticed that the part was decently hot. I ended up going the same rates as I do with aluminum everywhere else though. Uh, I sort of went conservative to start just because I haven't machined the metal before and after that I just went full bore and treated it like I do aluminum and it seemed to work out okay. Like I said, I just bumped up the, the coolant on the mister and that seemed to help things a lot. Turned out alright I think, so I think that's it for now. Thanks for watching.